Good morning from the Desatoya Mountains in Nevada. I'm out here camping by this wonderful year-round stream. It's such a blessing in Nevada when we come across streams that are still running in the middle of August. Today I'd like to share with you what I do for my morning routine to receive divine guidance. This is guidance to help me live fully in my day, to stay on my spiritual path, sometimes to help me with my problems, not knowing which choices to make or how to deal with someone who hasn't been particularly kind for me. I look for the highest and the good. So during this video, I'd like to take you through what I do in hopes that maybe you can find a way to similarly practice that will bring you peace and guidance and help you feel closer to the great I am. Now, since I'm Christian, I use words like Lord, God, but this is good for any faith. I believe all belief systems lead us to the same God. So I'd like you to start by planting your feet squarely on the ground. Do not cross your arms. Do not cross your legs. Please take three deep breaths. Breathe in deeply. Exhale. Breathe in deeply. Exhale. Breathe in deeply. Exhale. Now I would like you to say a prayer that has significance to you, that has power for you. For me, that's the Lord's Prayer. Or should you not wish to pray, sing a song. Sing a song that brings you closer to the universal power. Sometimes I won't say a prayer and I'll just sing a hymn. And I'll sing a hymn to help raise my vibration to help me feel like I'm communing better with the great I am, although we always are communing with the great I am. So hit pause, sing a psalm, or say a prayer that's important to you. Welcome back. Okay, so with your feet still planted firmly on the ground, your legs and arms uncrossed, please put your palms face up. I usually put them face up on my thighs. This is welcoming divine energy. This is welcoming God to fill us with divine energy. Now we're going to do some clearing. Dear Lord, or what other verb verbiage you use, please clear me of all lower negative energy. Please remove all lower negative energy and all energy that does not serve me. Please have it drain out of my body drain deep, deep into the earth. Once it gets to the earth, may the soil in your heavenly love cleanse that energy and return it back to where it belongs. Amen. As you're sitting here, imagine roots growing out of the bottoms of your feet. See those roots go deep, deep into the earth. Those roots are wrapping around the core of the earth, grounding you, grounding you to the physical, grounding you to Mother Earth. Now I want you to picture the lights from the heavens the lights coming down, heavenly light 
from the clouds, from the sky, and connecting to the top of your head. See this as a light highway between heaven and you to help facilitate communication between God's divine messengers and you. Now let's ask God to fill us with love. Dear Lord, please fill me. Please saturate every cell of my being with your heavenly love. Please saturate me so much with your love that I can easily share that love with everyone and everything I encounter today. Thank you, dear Lord. I now ask that you send down the very highest and best divine messenger to give me guidance that will help me in this day. Thank you so much. I appreciate you, Lord, and I love you, Lord. Amen. I now call upon the highest and best possible energy, the best possible divine messenger to come through now. Feel a tingling in your hands. Feel a tingling in front of you. Allow love and light to come into your body. Now's the time to ask the energy for its name. Ask the divine energy what it's come to share with you. You may not feel like you've made contact. You may not feel an energy. You may not hear a voice in your head. But know that since you have asked God and you have the intention to receive, you are receiving guidance. It may come to you through subtle means over the course of the day, or you may hear things through a song or something that will give you insight over your day. It took me almost a month to be able to actually sense or feel the energy as it came to give me guidance. Let's take a few minutes communing with that energy in silence and focusing on the now, focusing on the babbling brook, focusing on peace. Now, please thank the spirit, the energy, the divine messenger from coming, for coming to visit you. Thank that spirit and tell it goodbye. We always tell energies goodbye because we do not want those energies in our space. So tell it goodbye, tell it to have a good day. Then, please give your gratitude to God 
the great I am, the universal power. Please express your gratefulness for such unconditional love, for such enduring patience, for the blessings you have in your life. May you have a blessed day. May you know that you are loved greater than you can ever imagine. Thank you. While this video is short and this meditation is short, it gives you the tools so you can work on longer meditations and spend longer time in peace and in harmony. Have a great day. Thank you.